else. And on today's show, we are having Valentine's Day tryouts. That's right, we're meeting people desperate to become your Valentine. Oh, and look at that. Walking up to the microphone, it's our next auditioner. Give it up, me monkey nuts, for JJ! Hello, JJ, how are you? I'm good. Great, happy early Valentine's Day, or I should say, happy Valentine's Day Eve. Are you getting excited for the big show tomorrow? I am. Good. Okay, now let me just, before I ask you about your plans to be the perfect Valentine tomorrow, I'm wondering, have you hung uh, your stockings on the mantle? Do you have the milk and cookies out by the fireplace? Are you ready for Santa to come tonight? Well, I'm, I'm ready for Santa to come every night, so... Oh, good point. <laughs> so this is just a standing uh, agenda item for you. Every night, hang the stockings on the mantle with care, put out the cookies and milk, be sure to extinguish the fire in the fireplace just in case Santa uh, mixes up his calendar and shows up that night. Okay, good. <laughs> Glad we worked yeah. that out. Uh, tomorrow, Cupid is going to be shooting his little cute baby arrow uh, to make some loving Valentine's Day connections. J.J. Fellas. What are you prepared to do to be the perfect Valentine tomorrow? Well, I don't know, but I, don't, I think my sister knows. Oh, your sister? Uh, wait, what is your sister's name, JJ? Olivia. Oli is, is Olivia right there? She is. Oh, audience, give it up for JJ's sister, Olivia. <laughs> or I guess I should say Olivia, because it's Valentine's Day, right, Olivia? Can you change your name to Olivia tomorrow? Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> Excellent. I don't know if you have to go to the courthouse to do that. It's just a temporary change. I think you uh, do. Okay. You do? Okay. You gotta... <laughs> you, there's a lot of paperwork. Maybe just stick with Olivia. Uh, but you could just tell people to call you Olivia tomorrow. Uh, tell us, Olivia, what are you gonna do to be a perfect Valentine tomorrow? Um... I'm gonna show everybody love. Mm, be nice to everyone. All right, there you go. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so you want to uh, uh, present kindness to everyone, like a red carpet straight to your heart, uh, being kind to every single person you encounter. So let's just brainstorm here, Olivia. What are some ways that you can be kind to people tomorrow on Valentine's Day? Can you think of any uh, concrete things you could do, like like one thing you could do for every single person that you see? Um... You could, like, say hello. Oh, that's it. Okay. So greeting every single person that you see tomorrow. How many people do you <laughs> think you see in a in an average day, Olivia? If you had to guess, like, how many people would you see in a day? Mm, At least a hundred. Yeah, about a hundred. That's where my head was going, too. Probably a hundred people between all the kids in your class and the teachers and the custodians, all the other people around school. The people in traffic, don't forget the people in other cars. you got to wave to them and get them to roll down the window and yell hello. That's important. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of people to meet. Um, okay, so as you're saying hello to people, like, uh, could you, let's role play that really fast. Pretend that I'm just some stranger just minding their own business in the car. i got my hands at the 10 and 2 position. And then you gestured me to roll down my window, so I roll it down. Olivia, go ahead and call from your window over to mine, and uh, let's give this a try. Say to me what you want to say to people tomorrow in this situation. Hello, how's your day going? Oh, me? Oh, wait, are you talking to me? Yeah. Oh, oh, no one's ever asked me that before in traffic. By the way, I forgot to mention that yeah. I am a, uh, I'm a British nanny. No one's ever asked me that before in traffic. Uh, my day is going chip, chip, cheerily. And how is your day going today? It's, it's going great. Well, excuse me, uh, would you please be my valentine today? Sure. It worked. Olivia, you just became a valentine with a kindly British nanny who was driving a car. Audience, give it up for Olivia and JJ in Tennessee. That's how it's done.